Hey everybody, I'm Sin. Welcome to the Book Nook, where we talk about the awesomeness that is books. Today, we are going to be doing the My Favorite Things tag. I thought that'd be a fun one, and so we're going to get right to it. So the first question is, who is your favorite musician slash band? Well, overall, one of my favorite bands ever is Avenged Sevenfold. I've seen them probably... I think like 15 or 16 times, a lot. And then I have to add in, also I love David Bowie, two totally different animals of music. I know I was only supposed to choose one. Next question, what are your top three favorite films? I'm gonna have to make this five because I can't just choose three. So my top five favorite films are Donnie Darko, Almost Famous, The Big Lebowski, The Crow, and Dazed and Confused. <laughs> Those are my top five favorite movies of all time. Next one, what is your favorite scent? So when I was younger, vanilla was my favorite scent, but my new favorite scent in recent times has been the scent of amber, like amber oil or amber incense. I have a candle that's called Golden Amber and it smells amazing. So I love the smell of amber. And for weird ones that I like, I love the smell of chlorine, like chlorine from a pool. I'm really bad at just naming one thing, apparently. <laughs> well, I don't care. <laughs> All right, next question. What's your favorite Disney film? Alice in Wonderland is my favorite Disney film. I just love the weirdness of it. Embrace the weird, man. Next question is favorite season? Summer. I love the summer. I have always been... A water baby. I love to go swimming. I love to be outside. Michigan has uh, so many different like lakes and beautiful places you can go. Just the summer is really fantastic in Michigan. Seasonal drink. Well, are we choosing for every season or just for one season? Or if I have to choose one overall, I would have to go with cider. I love apple cider, but in the summer I love lemonade. So I guess I would have to say two seasonal drinks. Lemonade and apple cider. Favorite shirt or article of clothing? Now this kind of changes depending on, you know, you buy new clothes and sometimes that becomes your new favorite. I have like a weird shawl and it has the moon phases on the back. That is one of my favorite like articles of clothing, but it's not an everyday wear. Currently my new favorite shirt, I'm wearing it. This is books are wild. And I say that quite a lot, books are wild. Also, if you want a shirt that says Books Are Wild, there's a link down below. You can get one. So next, who is your favorite author? And can anyone really pick just one? I have a hard time picking one of anything, as you can tell from my answers to these questions. Uh, if I had to pick one, hmm, I know there's definitely a top three. Probably Clive Barker, A Magica, is uh, in the tops for one of my favorite books. So yeah, Clive, I guess Clive Barker, but we gotta give our shout out to our other two boys, Neil Gaiman and Josh Mailerman. Those are my top three favorite authors. Gotta fix the hat. No, I don't know. Favorite spot for reading or writing? Honestly, just in bed. It's comfortable. The cat always comes and chills with me. And it's, you know, it's a nice snuggly spot. Favorite food or dessert? My favorite dessert is chocolate mousse. My favorite food. I love all Asian food so much. Thai, Japanese, Korean, Filipino. Like if it's Asian, it's probably really freaking good. I love spicy. So give me some sort of Thai food and I'm happy. But overall, anything like any kind of Asian food, a big bowl of pho, aw, oh, dude. I'm making myself hungry right now thinking about this. Favorite time of day? The nighttime is the right time. I am a creature of the night. I like to go outside and look up at the sky and see the stars. Who knows? I might see a UFO. You never know. The nighttime. And I mean, I would love to be one of those people that say, you know, like just right at sunset, it's beautiful, it's quiet, the birds are just starting to awaken the world with their song, but I almost never wake up that early, ever. So, 
I, I can't say that's my favorite time of day if I almost never experience it. Favorite color, red. Red is hands down my favorite color. Close second would be purple. Top three favorite YouTube channels. Okay. So top three favorite YouTube channels would be The Jeff Word is one of my favorite booktubers. He's fantastic. Love that guy. I <laughs> love freaking Kelly Stamps. I don't know if you've ever watched her. She has nothing to do with books, but I freaking love how real she is and I love her damn videos. And the third one I love with Cindy. She's freaking funny and I enjoy her hot takes on whether she's doing a reaction video to movies or talking about books. Even if like half the books that she reads, I probably will never read. That's okay. She's just funny. I, I'm, I'm more of a, a personality watcher. I, if you got a good personality, like that sucks me in. Like I'm going to watch that video immediately. As someone who's been streaming on Twitch too for several years in the video game aspect of it, I've always been a personality watcher. Like I would watch streamers and I didn't care what the hell they were playing. Didn't matter. Like I like their persona and that's kind of what drew me to them. Next up, favorite musical or play? The best musical I've ever seen was Wicked. Oh, love Wicked. Amazing. Rent is good too, but Wicked, my favorite. I've actually seen quite a few musicals. All right, and favorite place you've ever visited. So I have always loved Crystal Blue Waters and the beach, and the best place I've ever visited was Aruba. It was so beautiful. The water is that like unimaginable sapphire blue, oh, like hanging out at the beach, going snorkeling, just lazy days, iguanas are just chilling. Maybe they're sitting on a chair next to you, staring at you, trying to have a conversation after you've had maybe a few too many drinks. I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, Aruba. Aruba. So yeah, that is the My Favorite Things tag. If you so choose and want to do this, go ahead. Like I said before, I don't like to just call out people to tag them because you got stuff going on in your life. People got to work their jobs and they got stuff they're working on for BookTube, but I don't want to interrupt that. But if you want to do this, consider yourself tagged. Thank you so much for joining me today in the book nook. If you had fun hanging out, boop that like button. Come back, see me again. And we'll talk about more bookish type things and whatnot. So until next time, we'll see you later. Bye.